Hello there, viewers, if there are any. Today I'm going to be showing you, a, I think I, sorry, I have no scripts. I think 11 different websites. All right, 11 different cool websites. First is stumbleupon.com. Stumbleupon is a website that'll that if you click this button up here that stumble, it will take you to any random website such as 70 cute baby animals that bring you to a good mood. And yeah, there's a bunch of baby animals that are cute on this website. I've never met this website. I use stumbleupon. I have you can sign up for an account, but you don't need to sign up for an account to do this. Next. BigHugeLabs.com slash H O C K N E Y dot P H P. What this does is it will take a picture and make it into a collage of different you could have it with polarized frames or no frames, which is that. And I will just pick a random picture. Um this you can change the background color, I'll just change it to, uh, I don't know, there, number of Polaroids, you can change the number, 20, uh, and then you click create, and, whoop, and then it will take a picture and turn it into a bunch of Polaroids. Next is lmgtfy.com, let me google that for you. This is, is it will, if you type in something like, hello, YouTubers, you can Google search and it will t send you a, it'll t put a link down here. And you can, um, tiny URL it, and then you can copy that and send it to friends if they were looking for something. I'll open a new tab, I'll click the button, I'm using block by the way, because Firefox won't open. And then it goes there, it will type, Hello YouTubers, it says click the search button, was that so hard, and it will take you to the search page. Next, lighttype.com. I, I kind of forgot what this does, because I haven't really checked yet. This is actually, okay, I click the English, oh, I know what this, this is the online keyboard. I remember it now. So... You can click over here to search on YouTube. You type in, I don't know, just type in random letters and you click search YouTube, books, Google, or anything else. And then you can click search and it will take you to this. Oh, it was pretty close. Didn't have that cue in there. Um, Alright then, next, online cursor editor, so you can draw your own cursor, uh, wah, wah, that's my cursor, that's a helper, I don't need a helper, I need purple, on. right, and then paint the inside of it, we have tenets, do that, and then you can draw all over that. Put a put a mouse in. Color it any color you want. It's a purple mouse. Why don't I pick purple? Because I like the color purple. Yeah, just gonna erase all the stuff. Do other stuff. Yeah. Uh, okay. Next, pixie.strd section, which is a basically just a, a draw online. You can draw it. It makes pixels. It's a pixel drawer. So if you are in the need for a game character or maybe a pixely logo, just go to pixie.strd6. I will be putting these links in the description. Next, qprompter.com. It's an online teleprompter. So. Uh, you could just type, I'll click small for the screen size, and just type, hello, you, 
Ubers. I don't care how I spell stuff. This is a test of prom. Okay. Alright, now you can change it mirror to mirrored. Change the font size to small. You can change it set black the background. I'm just gonna keep it at white text, black background. And there it is. Now it's in. I've made it mirrored, but display mode you can change it to norm too. Click forward, it'll scroll. Click reverse, it'll scroll back. But this is real short, so it's not going to be that much. Alright. Next out of that. Next. Ning.com. Create your own social networking site. You have to create an account. I don't have an account. But basically, you would put in the network name, the Ning network address, and a bunch of other stuff. Next. Busy.com. Transform your search from blah to bling. So, what you would do is you would type in, I don't know, um, YouTube, and you click, I don't care how I spelled that whatsoever, except it doesn't show up anything. Uh, oh yes, yes. And then you can have it to simple text to roll over to the pages, and then you can click web screenshot. So, you have this, it will load the screenshot. Power grid. That's what it has. Simple text was. This is all that. There's more. There's a lot more. There's a photo tag cloud, such as. See that you can drag it around. Have a bunch of photos, and a lot more. All right. Next, and I think this is our last one. Protopage.com. This is to create your free personal start pages. So you could change the title to YouTube test, and you could add widgets. The Gilbert, sure. You could add the. I don't live in London, so these people are kind of stupid. Mashable, all this other stuff to it. So, thank you. Don't forget to rate and subscribe. I mean, don't forget to rate and favorite. Subscribe if you like my videos. I'll see you next time. I don't know the hotkey, so I'm going to click over here.